Hi everybody, I'm Jeff from Missouri Wind and Solar and today I want to talk to you about cutting pole barn steel. It's this type of steel, I know tons of you guys out there have already bought this stuff, cut it, built pole barn sheds and that sort of thing. And it's the type of pole steel that has these big ribs in it. It's usually about three feet wide. And there's a bunch of ways to cut this stuff. And I just noticed a guy, Alan Bremer, was cutting skirting for around the bottom of his house. And he was doing it with, as a circular saw. And he's taking like an old paneling blade or plywood blade. And you turn it around backwards and you can cut sheet metal that way. That's one way to do it. Um, it works real good on aluminum siding. Or you buy an abrasive bit for your circular saw and that's another way to cut it that's actually better. But abrasive wheels don't last very long and they burn out. There's another way to try to cut this stuff and you can use like these tin steps and try that. And you guys have probably all did it. When you come to that rib and you're trying to cut out here in the middle of a sheet, it's a bummer. So I'm going to show you the way that I cut pole barn steel. I use this attachment and this goes on a cordless drill. It can even go on an electric drill. But these don't cost that much money. And I'm going to show you how it works. Now this one is a Malco. And it's made in the USA. All right, I got a Makita cordless drill. And that's what we've been using. I was doing a lot of pole barn building out here and cutting steel. This is how it works. You just chuck it in. And then this adjustable arm here opens up. And it's supposed to fit just about any size drill there is. And so far it has. That's it. Just that quick. Now I want to show you how well this works. Okay, it's pretty easy. Man, that dude works nice. They can cut right down the center of a rib. Just like that. Cut out circles. You want to punch out holes? Anyway, if you're going to cut a lot of pole barn steel, I suggest buying one of these attachments. It's not throwing a bunch of sparks and fire all over the place and tearing it up. Anyway, it's just a quick video. So I'm Jeff from Missouri Wind and Solar and that's how you cut pole barn steel.